you are worthy of it all yes you are for from you are all things and to you all are things you deserve the glory We'll never stop, we can't live without you, Jesus, we love you, and we can't get enough, all this is for you, Jesus, Lord, we love you. you Jesus we love you and we can't get enough all this is for you Jesus oh When you walk into the room, everything changes. Darkness starts to tremble at the light that you bring. And when you walk into the room, every heart starts burning. And nothing matters more than just to sit here at your feet and worship you. you we love you we'll never stop we can't live without you Jesus Lord we love you for you Jesus oh yes it is we love you we'll never stop we can't live without you Jesus, Lord, we love you. Oh, we can't get enough. All this is for you, Jesus. Sister Mary, I'd like to ask you to read from Scripture, please. This is from Acts 2, 38 and 39. Then Peter said unto them, Repent and be baptized every one of you in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of sin, and ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. For the purpose is unto you and to your children and to all that are afar off, even as many as the Lord our God shall call. thank you for this day and Jesus we ask you to pour out your Holy Spirit and bless this water and those who receive it to wash away uh, their sins and to clothe them in righteousness throughout their lives Lord Jesus that that dying with you they are raised with you and share in your final victory so Lord Jesus thank you for the grace that you bestow upon us here Father we pray these things in your name Amen. All right, I would like to ask uh, Alec, sir, if you would please come on down. All right, my friend. Now, Alec. 
Alec, uh, I want to ask you, do you uh, resist the enemy and the kingdom of darkness and repent of your sin? Yes. And do you accept the forgiveness, faith, love, strength, and mercy that Jesus Christ has for you? I do. And do you commit your life to Jesus Christ? Yes. Now, church, I want to ask you, do you reaffirm your rejection of sin and your commitment to Jesus Christ? Yes. Do you commit to praying for our brother, Alec, daily? And Alec, based upon your profession of faith, I now baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. <laughs> friend, uh, I ask you, Anthony, do you turn away from the kingdom of darkness and resist the enemy and repent of your sin? Yes. And do you accept the love, forgiveness, grace, power, strength, and mercy of Jesus Christ? I do. Do you commit your life to Jesus Christ? Yes, I do. Church, I'll ask you again. Do you reaffirm your rejection of sin and darkness? Yes. Do you commit to praying for, uh, or let me ask you this, are you still committed to Jesus Christ? Yes. Do you commit to praying for Anthony and discipling him and circling about him with the community of faith? Yes. Anthony, based upon your profession of faith, I now baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. to not believe them? Do you love Jesus? Do you accept His forgiveness and grace He has for you? Do you give your life to Jesus? Church, do you reject the lies of the enemy that's spoken over you that says you're not good enough, that you're not worthy, and that you're not loved? Yes. Do you accept the truths of forgiveness and grace through Jesus Christ? you commit to praying for Riley and discipling her and surrounding her in a community of faith? Riley? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Ready. Based upon your profession of faith, I now baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. She don't need to be held, right? She, she thinks. Oh, you know what's so tall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you're right. You're tall. Oh, she's very, very tall. Can you guys see her? Yes. Hey, Lily, look at me. Now, do you love Jesus? Uh -huh. Do you promise to not believe the enemy when he tells you that you're not special and that you're not loved and that you're not precious in God's sight? Okay. Do you promise to receive the forgiveness and love and mercy of Jesus for you? Mm -hmm. Do you commit and give your life to Jesus? Mm -hmm. 
Church, you promise to not believe the wicked one when he tells you that you don't belong to the family of God. Yes. Do you promise to embrace the truths of Scripture when Jesus tells you you are my beloved and you are my son and daughter? Yes. Do you promise to pray for Lily and to disciple her and to encourage her and to surround her with a community of faith? Yes. Lily, now, based upon your profession of faith, I now baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Church, if you would please bow your heads and I'll dismiss in prayer. Father, thank you so much for this day. Thank you for the celebration. Thank you, Lord, that we have received uh, your love and your mercy and your direction for our lives. Grant us continual and abundant wisdom and strength. Allow us to never grow weary or become isolated, but to be encircled by your grace, by your family, and by your church. Go with us this week. Father, we pray, lift up your face unto us, lift up and shine your countenance upon us, and be gracious to us. We pray these things in your name, Jesus. Amen and amen. Church, have a great day. You are dismissed.